Okay, starting a new um, fitness challenge today that uh, I'm calling the front and back challenge and it'll be six weeks long like my usual fitness challenges. Um, this is in addition to um, the total fitness challenge which is still underway which is at week four. So but today will be day one for the front and back and the idea behind the front and back is that um, we'll be working on abdominals and lower back. Um, I have uh, a few people doing this with me and that's where we want to go next was abdominals and lower back and so I put together basically a circuit of um, exercises for both um, parts of the body and then um, with minimal gear required and um, what I've what I've what I put together, uh, the circuit is as follows. Uh, it's going to start off with 10 um, Mayweather sit-ups, which are the sit-ups that go f f to the regular sit-up but to stand up, and uh, doing as best as, as you can to do the uh, Mayweather sit-up. Like I can't really do it perfectly myself, and a lot of times I don't even get up. Um, like I use a lot of momentum to try to. So start off with those where you got a lot of energy. 10 Mayweather sit-ups, followed by 20 uh, V-ups, um, followed by 10 back extensions or supermans, whichever you want to do. Like some, some people consider them the same thing. Uh, me, when I do supermans on the ground, it uh, bothers my stomach, makes me feel like I'm going to have a hernia or something. So, but I have a Roman chair and I do back extensions on the Roman chair and it, and it works out fine. Um, if you don't have a Roman chair, you pretty much got to go on the ground. And if you feel any pain like I do, I just wouldn't do the, those. So at least 10 of those, um, 20 opposite limb lifts from a high plank. And so I'll, I'll demonstrate what that looks like. It's just basically from the push-up position, raising your arm and opposite leg. Um, then 20 crunches, then 20 reverse crunches, then 20 side bends with the legs elevated, um, 20 per side. And so you can elevate your legs on a stool, on a chair, on a couch. I have uh, one of those Swiss balls that I never really use, so this is my opportunity to make some use out of the Swiss ball. Um, after that, 20 oblique crunches per side and 20 flutter kicks, 20 scissor kicks, 20 frog ups, and I'll show you what that looks like. The frog, the whole name frog up, I just, I just used that, I just made up that name. I don't know what they're actually called. Um, and then 20 angled pelvic lifts per side. And again, uh, that is gonna require like a couch or some, something kind of cushioned that's a little bit elevated. Um, to rest your shoulder on, 20 angled pelvic lifts, and then um, at the end, just do sit-ups, do 50 or whatever you can get to um, below 50. And if you like, you can do that. those at an incline to make them tougher. Um, I might do that today. I have an incline bench, but just depends on how I'm feeling, um, having done the circuit. So I don't know how long it's going to take to do it. Um, haven't you know and I don't know if these numbers are really good or if I need a little bit less for some or I need a little bit more for some so today is just totally experimental and I might adjust tomorrow um, so if anybody wants to do the challenge I know there was um, there was some who expressed interest uh, among the FMK um, YouTube viewers if you want to join in feel free to join in you can leave comments or links to your videos um, underneath my videos um, and just have fun for six weeks doing the circuit every day and every week maybe increasing um, increasing the numbers uh, a little bit so okay I'm gonna turn on some music and, and get started I'm gonna have to use reference my notes along the way because I haven't memorized the circuit yet
gonna try a couple of Supermans. Yeah, it really hurts my lower back or my uh, stomach. Feels like it's gonna pop out. <laughs> this
and it's pretty tough. We need some padding. That's one where the uh, numbers got changed. I proposed 20, 10 was enough. Yeah, so conversely with that one, the uh, flare kicks and scissor kicks did 40 instead of 20 that I proposed. <coughs> uh, the frog up. I'm 
talking about is this. a lot of coordination. And I guess what you're trying to do is line up your shoulder, hip and knee. Again, like the other uh, lower back exercise for me, 10 of those is enough for one side. It's going to be more difficult, no wall. sit-ups or incline if you have the opportunity. the legs. Whew. Yeah, there's some on the ground. So that is the circuit for the uh, for the front and back challenge for six weeks. Just try to improve on those. <sighs>